I think the thought of death recalibrates life. If you live to be 72 or whatever the average age, it's roughly 26,000 days that we get to live. I think I'm past halfway. When I was young, I had very eclectic and interesting opportunities to pursue aviation. Growing up around air shows, because my dad flew air shows. Known as the Tucker Upper. He's going to crank it around the corner, drive hard. I remember taking off for the first time by myself in a glider when I was 14. And it's like, I, it was the first time you look around, it's like, oh my gosh, like, my life is in my own hands. And so since I grew up around this, flying an airplane with no engine was kind of the precedent. And the better I get at it, the more fun it gets because, you know, you become master of the craft. I feel like, in general, I'm fairly risk averse. <laughs> Where's Phoenix? Phoenix! People choke, people slip and fall and hit their head on a curb. <laughs> Emphysema, malaria, dysentery, snake bite, bandits. <laughs> Just because there's wolves in the garden doesn't mean you can't go out and play, right? I had testicular cancer when I was 25. Boom! <laughs> you never know when your time's up. Well, oh, that's scary. A little bit. <laughs> the idea of dying really soon. I feel like you're shocked into the present moment of living. You know, maybe fear shocks you into the present just as much as adrenaline or pure joy or those kinds of things. Yeah, want to try karate chopping it? Maybe it's any alarming emotion. <laughs> Which I think is part of what drove me to do all this. in the present, the color of the poppies are like brighter orange than you've ever seen. And like, you know, all of a sudden you hear a bee buzz by your ear. Like, wow, that was amazingly visceral. I mean, it's just like this rad connection with this planet and all its ruthlessness and resiliency and maybe not clouded by consciousness. But why is it so rewarding? I don't know. It's it's just it's the jam. It's the juice. I hate doing my taxes. <laughs> You know, we root ourselves in kind of this Western mentality of like, the meaning of life is to find happiness, then let's do fucking something awesome, right? <laughs> like, what would I want my kids to do with their life? So I want them to get older. I want them to find something that they love and pursue it. I want them to share that with the people that they love and have the skills to actually accomplish it.
26,000 days to live. And if half of them are gone, then it recalibrates how I want to spend life. I definitely don't want to die doing what I love. But I want to live doing what I love. You like it? Golden brown, perfect. Mais <laughs> 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 <laughs>